All right, guys, uh, purpose of this video is I want to show you guys how to put programming into Stormbreaker, uh, bootcamp programming, or strength programming. So let's just do it. Uh, basically, you're going to open up Stormbreaker. You'll need access to it. Uh, from here, we're just going to use December Bootcamp. I'm actually going to name this CrossFit. So I'm going to take December Bootcamp, and we're going to plug in, I'm sorry, January Bootcamp, and we're going to plug in our first day. Our first day is uh, the first of the month, dynamic warm-up. We're going to plug all these pieces in. So let's do it. Once I am in Wattify, I'm going to go to uh, List. Uh, for the purpose of this, let's just create something from scratch. I'm just going to go to new wad. Let's enter some basic information here. So uh, the date where it says wad name, it's actually going to be the date. So the date that we're doing is programming Stormbreaker. It's going to be 1-1. One, one. So we're going to put 1-1-2019. One, one, That's going to be the same thing, 1-1-2019. One, one, it's going to be boot camp. And this is very important. Uh, and Nick is supposed to post at 5 p.m., correct? Or 6 p.m.? 5 p.m., that's what I thought. Uh, so after that, it's always going to be the date and the date. Here, remember, our posts go, are supposed to post at 7 p.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time. However, this is like a central time, so you always want to make sure it's 5 p.m. 5 p.m., 5 p.m., so it's 5 p.m. the day before. So if it's 1 1, 12 31 is that. So the day before, this is always that. That's boot camp. I'm going to go to save. I got it in. It's locked and ready to go. Okay, let's add some sections. First thing we're going to add is this AMRAMP, right? So that's our dynamic warm up. Nick put it in the right spot. I'm going to go Command C. And just because it says dynamic warm up, uh, I mean, we'll be in two lines when we do this, but add section. I'm going to go to, we'll just put warm up. And then it gave me that. And I'm going to go to warm up, click that. I'm going to comment. And I'm going to put, I'm going to erase this. So you see, every time I paste it, it gives me these quotes. I don't want any quotes. I'm a formatting king. It has to look nice. We're going to save. There's our warm up, MRAP 4. Here, I'm going to go to the Metcon of the Strength. So this is a Metcon. I'm going to add a component, or rather uh, a section. It's going to be Metcon. Put my Metcon right there for me. I'm going to go to add the uh, custom component, new custom Metcon. New custom Metcon is always going to be our, our, our benchmark, our piece. So I'm going to go here, copy and paste. Just know that whenever it's a Stormbreaker, it's you, it should be correct. And if it's not correct, it's not necessarily the person's fault who's copying and pasting this. Metball squat those everything's in. Everything I'm removing my quotes. Literally, this, this is literally a copy and paste situation. Uh, kettlebell. I'll fix this in there. Kettlebell. We don't like abbreviations. We want to make sure. Hey Nick, on on uh on the first day, don't abbreviate kettlebell. It's abbreviated on day one when you get a chance. Everything's in, copied and pasted. I make sure there's no spaces, no quotations. Uh, choose option for scoring. So if I'm going to score this right, uh, I don't really, there's not, unless it indicates score, there's not really a score. So I'm just going to come in here and I'm going to put uh, no measure. If there's no scores, no measure. And I'm going to go here where it says coaches notes. I'm going to insert my comments. Comment. Command V. See these quotations that come with it? Gotta go. And I'm gonna go ahead and save. AMRAP is loaded in. That's the Metcon. Then I got another section. My last section is on a roll. I don't have that section, so let's create it. Create a new custom Metcon. Uh Create a new custom component. We're going to call it on roll. 
Oh, I'm sorry. We got to add a section. Create a new section. I'm going to call it honor roll. Save. And we have a Tabata Superman hold, hollow body hold. Uh, create custom component. No measure. And save. There we go, guys. That is how you input that. AMRAMP 4, warm up, there's our Metcon, and there's everything we wanted here, right? And I'm going to go ahead, it saves automatically, go back to list. Now, here's the cool thing. When you're doing your next Metcon, we can really just copy the wad for the next day, right? It's the same type of situation. So I'm just going to click here, and I'm going to go to copy wad to another day. And it brings up the same criteria. You just got to change a couple of dates. So all I'm going to do is change this to 1-2. I'm going to change this to 1-2. And there we go. And there we go. 1-1 one, one at 5 p.m. When you copy and paste it, it changes the constituents for you. So you don't got to input it all the time. I'm going to save. From here, I'm going to come do the same thing. I got an AMRAP, I'm just going to change it. I've already kind of did the layout for myself. Delete this, copy, paste. And again, this is just a copy and paste role. If the person inputs this correctly, all you're really doing is moving quotation marks. Quick side note, if you notice, if you are program savvy and kind of know what's going on, if you see an error, you need to email uh, your site manager uh, to, uh, to make adjustments. Command V, 30 minute EMOM, deleting my quotes. Uh, now let's see if there's a score. This is an EMOM, I don't have any scores right here, so I'm cool. I'm gonna copy that. Delete the old notes, insert the new notes. And there you go. I got no measure again. Everything's good. No quotations. Save. Voila. Lastly, extra credit. Honor roll is going to be hamstring stretch. So, call it here. Put this. Command V save. A lot. We are laid out. We're good to go. That's two days in. So, because I'm not going to bore you with the details, uh, just always do this. And make sure you double check it, right? I'm actually going to click boot camp again now that I put these two in and I'm going to edit it. I want to make sure my details right so I make sure my clients see this in advance. 1111, it's boot camp and it's the day before at 5 p.m. Looks good to me. Then I'll do that. 112, boot camp, boot camp, edit. 1212, 1111 at 5 at 5. Guys, that is how you uh, input programming from Stormbreaker to Wattify. Not super hard. Thank you and have a blessed day.